happy Friday, guys. Starting off, deep apology. Deep, deep, egregious error. Yesterday, I made Professor Peel, and here she is working on her robot. I'm doing monkey things, making monkey puns, and my buddy Johnny P pointed out, he was just waiting for it. Why did I not call this? I called it a wrench. Why did I not call this a monkey wrench? It's a monkey. It's a wrench. It's a wrench that looks like a banana. How? How did I miss this? Deep apologies. Monkey wrench going forward. It looks like a banana. My word. All right. Back to the island. We're going to go, you know, so we were over here. We were chilling over here in the uh, at the observatory. We're going to go back into the city. We're hanging around the city a little bit this week. After a little bit of a renaissance stretch there for a little while. So today, with a little toy here, I've got... I found this actually of the kids. So is it mine? Even if it was mine, guess what? I'm proud, but it's not. It's kids. It is this um, woodsy uh, raccoon. And we need a raccoon. And this one's so cute, isn't it? With a little tail. And they are known as trash pandas. You know, you've probably heard that term before, right? So I decided that we need... You know, somebody's got to take out the garbage here on the island. And why would it not be the people that like the garbage anyway? The pandas. We'll just put them in here with this little eye mask. I know, I think it's kind of unfair to call them a trash panda, but maybe I think they just took it as a term of endearment and decided that's what people are going to call them. They're just going to go with it. So they open up this trash panda service taking out the garbage maybe a lot of this is even like instead of just like trash pen maybe they do a lot of recycling too a lot of the stuff they could probably bring to professor peel and she can you know she can uh dock brown it in and put it in vehicles oh we already have bubbles she's gonna find something maybe the garbage powers of the robots we just, we, we just need to all right hold on I got an idea. I'm gonna make the garbage truck here, and he's he's hucking this in there, just hook. And but then it's gonna have like a divider in the middle, like when you go for Froyo, and you can put that thing in the middle. So this side will be trash of the garbage truck, and then there'll be a second side of the garbage truck that will be for recycling. And and then there's so there's gonna be another trash panda here, and he's gonna be dumping out this bin they're doing it by hand and uh in fact and then since uh you know what since johnny p since you are the one that uh brought up the the omission there i'll, I'll name this can be this guy's gonna be johnny so you get to be a garbage taking out panda bear and john whenever we're hanging out i always always think that we're gonna meet up with chad too so this one doing the recycling over here it gets to be chad so that way you guys can't complain because you have to be garbage men together like charlie and emilio and men at work Anybody remember that movie so all right i'll jump ahead i'm gonna sketch this in a little bit and then just throw in some more details and kick in some ideas but uh you're getting the idea it's taking shape we'll be right back all right, now we'll just sketch on in here. Do, 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 do. So we got our trash pandas just out to work on a nice day. They actually seem like they're enjoying their gig. They get to get a lot of fresh air. And it's nice that it's all garbage and recycling all in one truck. So like my garbage gets picked up on Fridays recycling every other week but the garbage truck comes and then usually just a minute behind that comes the recycling truck but wouldn't it be nifty if they could do it all in one fell swoop i forgot when i was first sketching this in that wait raccoons have tails i'm just gonna guideline it in here a little bit to do, do, do 
while I was sketching this and while I took that break, the mail came to deliver us some puzzles because we are keeping ourselves entertained while the kids are doing school at home. And we realized we really enjoyed doing puzzles, but really didn't have very many. So we ordered a bunch from Legacy Toys that's here in Minnesota. And they were like, even they had a lot of stuff was all sold out, but they had puzzles for us so they just came in so we're gonna be rocking puzzles through the weekend because it's Friday boom there's Johnny and then here's his partner in crime he's gonna have his sleeves rolled up because golly that Chad he's just working he's working really hard I wonder if he's working harder than working harder than John I don't know what do you guys think so that's what you have to do to get your character. You just have to point out some flaw in my logic or something. And then, ta-da. I don't know if that's necessarily true, but eh, it worked this time, I guess. He's going to be looking slightly more miserable, though. Maybe. I don't know why, because he's on recycling duty. And usually you think of the recyclables as being a little cleaner than the regular trash right because usually it's cardboard and dry stuff and they expect the garbage to be a little bit more gross and drippy i don't know i'm not a trash man so i don't know i suppose they don't call it a trash man anymore do they they call it like a waste disposal technician or something <laughs> i don't know so I decided to give it these funky little tail lights because this usually the garbage can just or the garbage truck just looks like a stick of butter on wheels. It's just this kind of nondescript box, but I decided to jazz it up a little. It's not that jazzy, but it's something. And so it's idling, it's not turned off, so it's still just ever so slowly pumping out a few bubbles here lest we not forget. And so I realized, remember I said, so I got another, I said it was gonna all be scooters on this island, but then I was like, wait, we need a bus. And wait, the garbage man can't come pick up all the garbage on a scooter. Think of how many trips he'd have to make. It would take him all the moments of his life. He'd have to dedicate his life just get scooting around on a scooter, picking up one bag at a time. But then think of how accomplished he'd feel when he's done. But probably by the time he got to one end of town, the garbages would all be full by the time it'd be a never-ending cycle of trash. Oh boy. So what are you guys all gonna do this weekend? This weekend we got garbage pickup in the morning, which I'm really excited for now. I'm going to go wave down the garbage man and go, oh, look what I did. Look at, I made it thinking of you. And he will grumble and he'll throw a banana peel on my head. And then I'll come inside and sulk. No, that's not going to happen. He wouldn't do that. There we go. I'll throw a bubble here. And then the truck goes like that. And this goes like that, and that goes like there, and that's going to go like that. I decided I put this divider line because I'm going to paint it like the recycling side is going to be blue for recycling, and then the garbage side will be green. I don't know. Or vice versa? I don't know. There. So I'll even put... T R A S A trash on this side. And then over here we'll put this sign for recycling. I don't know if I have this going the right direction, but if I don't, I'll just say this is the ampersand island version. So leave me alone. I did it my own way. And all right, I'll finish inking this in. 
we'll go to the turbo paint and then we'll just see what this ended up looking like when it's all said and done. I like the idea of a couple different colors for this thing too because it'll kind of brighten up the image here a little bit. Otherwise it's gonna be gray pandas with a gray truck on a gray ground of the side of this alley. And we gotta we need to perk it up. And all right, well I'll draw in that background. Turbo painting time. And there it is in all its glory. We got Johnny P here and we got Chad here, Mr. Chadwick. And it's time to take out the trash. It's Friday, which is my trash pickup day. So this goes out to my waste disposal representative. Hopefully you watching this video wasn't a waste. I don't know if I have any more trash puns, but you can throw them down there. And maybe I'll recycle them later. Oh, yeah. Happy Friday, everybody. See you tomorrow.